So I want to start off this video thanking three main people that I met through my time on Shopbo and MindZ. Uh, same goes to uh, Scythe, which I'm going to talk a little bit more about. Uh, the most fun I've ever had on the game was hacking in this clan called Team VG, where we basically killed Shopbo uh, by hacking on Mine Z. Uh, at the time, we didn't realize the implications of that would be that we would kill HCF too. Uh, but at the time, we weren't concerned with that. And uh, yeah, I do regret it, but what's done is done. And that was the most fun I've had playing the game. And uh, yeah, we were cheating and we ruined the server because we were banned unjustly. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. Now, I before... Team VG completely killed the server. I stopped playing to go play Kohi with Venezuela. Uh, thanks to Catmare uh, being friends with Salty, Salty Savvy, and Swag and Sheep at the time, I was able to get an invite fairly easily. And I want to thank Cat for that, and obviously Salty for actually 1v1ing me and giving me the chance to join, and uh, Sheep for being a great guy and probably the greatest leader to play the game. So, yeah, I did that. I got banned. If you want to know why I got banned, I got banned because of Glory Blade, but that whole time I played legit, I was not banned for cheating. If you want to know, Glory Blade streams a lot. His link's in the description, you can ask him. And I've apologized to Glory Blade for that incident, and uh, I own up to it. I take responsibility. It's my fault. I know no one ever talks about it anymore, and it's ne it would never get talked about if I didn't bring it up, but I'm going to bring it up, and uh, I've already apologized to Glory, but. Uh, in case he forgot or doesn't remember, yeah, Glory, like, that was my fault, I'm sorry about it, and, uh, I wish it never happened, but, it did, so, during that time I was banned, uh, you know, all I did was play Counter-Strike, and, uh, I got Global Elite legit, I didn't cheat, me and Jay Luna were 16 RWS on ESCA before Ranks came out, after Ranks came out, we got... A plus, we were floating around 17 RWS, we were actually very good at the game. Uh, but yeah, Jay Luna was actually cheating on matchmaking for a little bit, and uh, and then he just stopped cheating, and he was still really good when he switched over to ESCA. Uh, obviously a little bit worse, but still very good after a month he got up to pace. So, And uh, yeah, uh, then I started playing CS with Lee. And uh, Lee had a good friend called Ben, who was friends with Stove, Minor Joe, who unbanned me on Koei, and I started playing that, and that's when I started uploading videos again. Uh, so, the main thing here is, I've never cheated on Koei, I've been SS'd on Koei, which I know this is kind of left out, I didn't upload the video, because I wasn't allowed to record it, but, yeah, I was SS'd on Koei, I obviously didn't get banned. Um, so, yeah, I didn't cheat on Koei, um... So yeah, fast forward PvP lounge, it, you know, during PvP lounge I kind of accomplished the rest of everything I wanted to accomplish, uh, beating all, everyone, like there's no one I haven't beat that's worth beating on the game, so I accomplished everything I wanted to pretty much. And uh, shout out Big Man Tixo. Uh we became friends on Badline and uh, we played CS together as well, so that's another person I'm kind of leaving out, but... Yeah, basically there's no nothing left for me to do in the game. Uh, and basically, I've spent all my time getting good at two games, which now the issue is a lot of people cheat in those two games, and there's, there's no fun just being legit when almost everyone that you're facing is cheating in some way, shape, or form. So, I'm not using that as an excuse to start cheating. I'm just gonna start cheating. I just wanna have fun, and uh, that's all it is to it. I've already made my decision. I just wanna thank everyone that's ever subscribed to me. Uh, I'm sorry that I'm disappointing you by, you know, not uploading the type of content that you guys wanna see, but uh, this is the truth, and to be honest, I haven't really uploaded any good content within the last seven months anyway. All, all my good content was before that. You guys may think the content I've been uploading is good, and, you know, that's that's great, but in all honesty, that's not the truth. Uh, 
I'm not being honest with myself if I if I'm saying that I've been uploading good content because I haven't. I've had no inspiration. I mean, obviously, the videos I was uploading a year ago are way better than the videos now. Uh, that's obvious, and uh, yeah, I I find that there's no real need for me to play the game anymore, and. Uh, I was going to leave a list of people in the description that have influenced me, but there's no point in doing that uh, because I think everyone that I'm friends with right now knows who they are, and obviously, I mean, you would just know, right? So there's no need for me to list your name, you know, just to be honest. As for the future of my channel, I'm going to be uploading me cheating on MM, and uh possibly other leagues in the future. I'm not going to talk too much about it because I don't want to start a whole bunch of drama, but for right now, just uh, closet cheating on MM, but it's not really closet cheating because we do go pretty hard, as you guys will see, so at least it sh should be something funny to watch. The reactions are pretty great, so. So I want to thank everyone that's ever subscribed to me or anything. It really does mean a lot. Uh, if you guys think I uh, cheat now because I'm cheating in CS now, then <laughs> go for it. Honestly, any game you can get good at fairly easily. If you have decent hand-eye coordination and good equipment and all that, you should be able to get decently good. And uh, yeah, then it just takes a bit of practice to know what you need to do to win. And once you get to that point, which I'm sure it's a lot harder now that Koei's not a thing, but back then you could get to that point fairly quickly, so. But yeah, uh, just to clear a few things up, I've been normal clicking since maybe 2013 on Koei. I've always been able to click fast, just normally clicking. I've never actually relied on jitter clicking to win a fight. That's something, you know, I just didn't do. Uh, I may have jitter clicked a few fights, but honestly, it's... I felt no need when I can normal click, you know, anywhere from 8 to 12, sometimes higher. Um, and, you, and I know people are going to say, you know, that's just the me method for fast clicking, but it's really not. I, I don't vibrate anything. I just click the mouse. Like, this is just me clicking the mouse. And if I really want to beat someone 100%, I'll just butterfly click or whatever uh, to do that. And uh, if the server doesn't permit butterfly clicking, I'll just use DC Prevent. And uh, the new version of DC Prevent 3.0, which has been around, I shouldn't say new because it's been around for a while, but I've never released it, actually would limit your CPS. So you couldn't, like, I could, this is like 20 CPS, but basically it would only show as like anywhere from 10 to 16. It wouldn't let you go higher than 16, and it wouldn't hit 16 a lot. You can see that in a lot of my older PvP launch videos. So I want to thank all of you guys for subscribing to me in the first place at one point in time. Uh, it means a lot. I'm sorry that I have to deviate from the type of stuff you expected, but this is what I want to do now. I've already stated I don't find the game fun anymore, so yeah, and hopefully I should be uploading more frequently as well, better content, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy.